Ken Surfs here with another video. I told you I'd have to be cranking them out because I have uh, so many cool products to review. And uh, I want to thank James, uh, one of the subscribers. Uh, he was uh, very nice to send me some other Soap Commander soap. And you've already seen the one that I've done a review on. I have one more to do besides this one. Respect. And I really like this because it's lime and patchouli. Ah, oh, lime, lime, lime. And I got some, he sent me a sample of his, uh, of some Bay Rum Aftershave by Ogalala. I'll probably have butchered that name. So uh, we're going to be trying that out today. And I will be using the uh, Wolf Whiskers brush with that, with the Parasso. And uh, I'm going to use the Mercure 34 with the blade in it that was uh, on yesterday. And uh, we'll see how that goes and I'll get this set up. Oh, and in one of the last video, a gentleman had asked uh, when I was telling him about my muscle cars from the old days, when I had my 65 Mustang Fastback stolen from in front of my mother's house back in 1980, one week before finals at college, all my books, all my homework, everything was in the trunk of that car. Gone. Never got it back. They gave me enough money to buy a, a 65 coupe, and I've had that ever since. So here's a picture of what that car looked like in 1981 followed by a picture of what it looks like 10 minutes ago in my driveway. All right, this is Ken Surf's back in 1981. I was in a photography class and uh, we had to take some color photos when I was in college. So I took this photo of uh, me in the car up on uh, in Palos Verdes, California. So man, I wish I could be that weight again. Nice and skinny. All right, that was it in uh, 1981, and here it is in nine, or 2016. Just got a bath. All right, I've got that Parasso on, and man, that soap whips up really nice. So let's see. It smells great, too. Let's see how it does. A lot of you were right on the comments on my previous video. Dallas. I'm going to go to Dealey Plaza, look at the Grassy Knoll, the book depository, which is no longer that. It's a museum. Uh, never been, never been to Texas, so it should be nice. Man, that soap's nice and slick. I want to apologize to one of the viewers that uh, last video or uh, the uh, the Wolfman video, I put uh, Queen, not the Kinks, Queen's uh, Lazing on a Sunday Afternoon from uh, uh, Night of the Opera. And right away, they tagged it as copyrighted material. And now they reserve the right to uh, place advertising and collect royalties from my video. I can either agree to that or I can pull the video. So I'm going to watch this. I'm not going to, I don't think, put any songs on uh, videos anymore. But uh, that's their right. They own it. But because of that copyright restriction, it limits the number of devices or the types of devices that a person can view it with. So apparently you can't view the video. <sighs> Go figure. I think I had about 30 seconds of the song on it. So if you see advertising, it's not from me. The only one who didn't bug me about videotaping songs and putting it on uh, from a concert, well, two people, Elton John didn't bug me and uh, Billy Idol. They didn't nail me, but uh, Rick Springfield did, <laughs> and Alice Cooper did. Nope. 
Nice. Very nice. Phone's ringing. The answer machine picks up, the dog will go nuts. Can I interest you in solar power? No. Then when they get the answer machine, they hang up. You call them back, it's not a real number. Telemarketers. Uh. All right. Now we're going to try this out. Mm, Bay rum. Nice. Nice. Thanks again, James. I really appreciate it. And thanks for watching. Hopefully I've kept this under eight minutes. Till next time, it's Ken Surf saying have a great night.